friends, welcome back to She's in Her Apron. Today I'm gonna to be sharing with you a couple of grocery hauls and then I'm gonna put a meal plan together for the next like week or so. So come along with me today. All right, let's start with the Costco haul. I ran in really quick to get some lactose-free milk for Jonah. He's doing really well on this. We used to buy it from forever ago and then he was doing okay, but mm, nope. His tummy just can't handle it, his system. So we got him the lactose-free milk, he loves it. His skin is clearing up, it's amazing. All right, the, I walked by the peaches and they smelled amazing, I had to get some. So they're, I would say in like, they're almost there. Some of them are ready to eat now. And their strawberries are so good. I ate some while waiting for the bus to come get the kids, uh, drop off the kids. They're gorgeous and they taste so good. And I was also nibbling on the blueberries. Oh, they are so good. All right, I ha got Earthbound Farms Organic Power Greens to put in our smoothies. The Frigo Cheese Heads String Cheese. Shaylee's already dived into it for her after school snack. She's so happy, she's so happy. I love them. So you good. love them? Okay, and then the artisan romaine lettuce. Um, we can eat, Derek and I like to eat our chicken fajitas in these. And um, I ha made some chicken salad yesterday. So I'm going to be eating in that. I love how this romaine is nice and tight. I've always wanted to try their their corn on the cob. And so it's super, supposed to be super sweet. So we're going to give this a try. The Cape Cod chips were on sale, and I love Cape Cod chips, and even the reduced fat is yummy, so I grabbed that so we can have that uh, for snacks and in their lunches. The Teton, oh my gosh, I love these grass-fed. Yeah, Shaylee loves these. I these like are the, the, the cooked, uncured Polish sausage. I often like this. So you like the hot, is it the jalapeno one or the Italian? The jalapeno. The jalapeno, oh. the seeds in it. Oh, they have a lot of versions of this and they're delicious. Mm -hmm. And more lunch meat because we've been going through it so fast with their sandwiches and I'm gonna be freezing some ham sandwiches for school Good lunch. Idea. Mm -hmm. So that's the Costco haul today. So let me show you the breads that I got from a bread outlet store near me. And I grabbed two of the Granny Sycamore breads. I got the fresh loaves for $2. The, by the time I was already in there and it was one-ish, all the like, oh, about to expire ones were gone and they were like, they're usually like a dollar something. But two dollars for gra Granny Sycamore bread is amazing. Um, I grabbed some English muffins for our breakfast sandwiches that I'm freezing. The kids love the mini bagels, so I grabbed plain, and they love like cinnamon and sugar on their toast and bagels, but this one is brown sugar and cinnamon, so I'm gonna have them give these a whirl. And then this French bread just looked amazing. Ah. This French bread looked amazing, so I grabbed a loaf, and then when you spend over $10, you get something free off of a shelf that has certain things, so I grabbed more English muffins, since I'm gonna be freezing breakfast sandwiches. All right, so that is the bread outlet. All right, then I ran into a grocery store um, near an appointment that I had this morning, and they had some great deals. So the I grabbed two original life boxes of cereal and two of their cinnamon, but I think everyone likes the plain. I couldn't remember, but I like the cinnamon. Um, these were a dollar eighty-eight a box. So were the Kellogg's Frosted Mini Wheats, and we already went through that box from our big back-to-school Costco haul. If you remember that one, I'll leave a link. That's already gone. So I got two of those, and then the Malto meals were also on sale for a dollar eighty-eight, and I wanted to compare and taste and and just see. So, and then we grabbed bananas. My family goes through bananas so fast. <laughs> yeah, in Boston. Yep, so fast. I grabbed these beautiful peppers. We have red, yellow, and orange. We're gonna have chicken fajitas. You'll see that on my menu plan. These gorgeous big cucumbers. Look at these tomatoes, tomatoes on the vine. Oh my gosh, they are so good. I love this store's um, seasonings. I have a lot in my cupboard. This one is a Garden Goodness Vegetable Seasoning. So I was like, oh, I wanna try this on some veggies. Um, in here we have 
dehydrated vegetables like garlic, red pepper, bell pepper, sun-dried tomatoes, green onion, green bell pepper, spices, salt, sesame seed, lemon peel, and sesame oil. So I, yeah, I'm excited to try that. All right, I wanted to try this cilantro dressing from Lighthouse. I love their ranch, and I'm going to give this a whirl because we're going to make Cafe Rio chicken. A bag of chopped romaine lettuce um, with um, a cabbage. I'm going to make chopped salad and I can use that lettuce but I have some recipes already in mind for that. So I just grabbed a big bag of chopped romaine and with the head cabbage to do chopped salad. And then some garlic. I don't like buying the big bags of garlic from Costco anymore because they seem to go bad really quick even though I use a lot of garlic all the time. So I've just been buying a few cloves here and there. Some more celery. The kids are loving this um, in their lunches um, with peanut butter. And then avocados. I've been eating a half of an avocado in the mornings for the good fats. And then onions. I'm constantly going through onions. Oh my goodness. So, all right. So here is my grocery haul. All right. Then I ran to Smith's later and I grabbed some gala apples. We have a few left, so I didn't get that many, just four. Some nectarines. They look so good, they smell good. Some grapefruit, red grapefruit, and plums, and watermelon so I can make a fruit salad for the kids for their lunches. Some naturally hardwood smoked bacon, two packages. Um, some petite red potatoes and gold potatoes for a breakfast bowl for Derek, donuts for the kids. Some sweet baby rays dipping sauce, and the honey barbecue sauce. Some ice cream, cookies and cream, and the Tillamook mudslide ice ice cream. This looked really good. I grabbed an ice drink and butter, unsalted and salted, and then the Homestyle Ranch one, and it was cheaper at Smith's. So this was Smith's, and uh, yeah, so we are set. For a while. All right, I'm gonna jot down some meals that I can make with my grocery haul and meals that I know that I can make that are already in my freezer. I like to give a ton of options, so I'm not like, eh, let's go out to eat. <laughs> so, um, with that ricotta cheese, I can make a uh, lazy man lasagna, the Cafe Rio chicken. I do have a video on that, I believe. All, there'll be a ton of links down below for recipes. Um, chicken fajitas, because we got those peppers. Oh, they're gonna be so good. Fruit salad with the dinners, and they could take that to school. Chopped salad with those sausages. Oh, yum. And we, we put like hard boiled egg with them, cheese, oh, so much. So I do have a video on that, so look for that. Um, I have some roasts I need to use up, because um, our cow will be coming soon. We're, we're running low, but uh, I do want to do the French dip sandwiches, because what I didn't show you on the haul was um, I stopped in another store this week and got um, some like individual, like really hearty rolls for the, um, the Instapot fresh dip sandwiches. Oh, those are good. I have a video on those. Those are addicting. Next, I'm gonna be making the breakfast sandwiches for the breakfast freezer meal video. Um, if it's up already, go check that out. There's gonna be ones with English muffins and bagels. And with that, we're gonna be doing the country breakfast bowls. And yes, I'm putting it on here because I don't want to forget that I'm making that, you guys. <laughs> I have ADHD if you didn't know that. All right, so um, I do have the other French bread slices that you saw for garlic bread. Um, I think I'm going to make um, my American chop suey. It's not like what you think. It's not a Chinese meal, but it's what my mom called it. Uh, I'll share that with you. Yeah, and if I film any of these, I forget in the process. I'll share them with you. I'll show some clips after this. Um, let's see, smoothies in the mornings. I do want to make some pico with all those tomatoes. 
and um, and if I I ran out of room. <laughs> okay, so if I make anything different on here, I'll show it in the next few clips. So good start. I do have this cute stand that I found at Ross uh, about a year ago for four bucks. So what I'm gonna do is I am going to tape this. Yeah, I'm already in the Halloween spirit. Of course. So I'm gonna put this out on my counter so it's, or I could tape it to the fridge, but this is way more motivating than just on my fridge. All right, let me share with you if I got to film any of the meals and enjoy. Mmm, Parmesan cheese. Oh. Mm. Yummy. Uh -huh. friends down in the comments below leave me what you're planning to make for the week so that way we can get a few ideas all right thank you so much for joining me we'll see you soon bye toodles, toodles. okay friends I am editing this video and this sweet puppy never leaves my side and you guys have noticed it in videos she is always at my feet <laughs> she's always at my feet hi Paige hi you say hi to our friends yeah you're such a good puppy. You're so sweet. Do you get a haircut tomorrow? Are you gonna be a brand new pup tomorrow? Yeah. Can you say bye to everybody? Say bye, friends. <laughs>